Okay guys, welcome back. Now, as usual, I'm going to do a review, but this time it's kind of different. Usually, I review some price figures which is not for sale. It was supposed to be a price for a game, like a crane game. But now, we're going to review a real figure that is meant to be sailed. So, yeah. This is Figuarts Mini. It is number 006 as you can see. On the front of the box, there is the photo of the figure, only the face, with its writings, and also the name of the character. And this Bandai logo, and also Tamashii Nations. In here, in the left side, is the logo of the Figuarts Mini, the number, and also the photo of the figure, and the name. And on the right, there is the photo of the figure fully from the top to the bottom with its name and also Figuarts Mini. And in the back here, there are some preview of the figure as you can see, the face, the full figure and also another pose of the figure. And this is only the price sticker so don't worry about it. There is these things which is telling about the photo of the figures here. And in the bottom, there's warning, some writings, and also SNI sticker. In the bottom, there is pretty much nothing. It's only like this sticker, which is Bandai with this uh, writing, the name of the figure, Figures Mini, and also the other things. And also, most of the figures are sales outside Japan only. I don't know why, but yeah, it is what it is. So... In this one, it it has a plastic outside it. So let's just take out the plastic first. So guys, this is the figure. I have cut on off the plastic and let's take out the figure. So it is open from the sides and not from the top or from the bottom. So let's take out the figure now. When you open it, there is the instructions and also this barcode, which is a QR code, not a barcode. I'm sorry. And this is a number, maybe for the model number. And here it is. And this is the box itself. So this is the figure. Let's get things out first. So guys, it turns out nothing is taped in. So yeah, first there is this arm. And the figure itself, of course still in the plastic here let's take it out so this is the figure itself this is the stand and this is the only thing that is taped which is like the shield of the character so let's open this up so guys let's review it from the additional first so first is this shield as you can see, this is quite big. In here, there is the writings, which are supposed to have a meaning on the anime. On the top here, there are some details, which is silver colored. And also in the bottom here, there is these dots and also some patterns here on the sides. And on the back, there is basically nothing. And this is supposed to go to the hands, I suppose. So yeah, now let's move on to the additional hands. So in here, her hands is the same as the one in her right now. But the difference here is she's holding this kind of thing which is supposed to go into the back of the shield as you can see here there is this little rectangle thing which this is supposed to go in and for the hand itself the additional hand is the same as in the figure next up is the stand the stand is a stand of course and in here there is figures mini and unlike in the price figures, 
there is no writings made in China and all that other stuff on the bottom but it is on the sides as you can see there yes it is written on the sides now let's move on to the figure so figures mini is of course a mini figure as you can see so let's review it from the top in here her hair is quite of a gray pink color with her right eye closed by the hair but it is actually open as you can see there and there is her left eye coming out and the mouth going to the back it's her hair only going to the middle section there is her um like a battle dress with the armors there is this little hole for it to stick to the stand the little details there as you can see there is like an s on both sides in the back in the front near her neck there is some linings with color and there is that half S here on both sides and also in her hand she has this kind of like wrist guard with plus sign on both of them going to the bottom section she wear this shoe which is heavily guarded with the socks there as you can see the black color and on the bottom of the shoe there is no texture so yeah and also there is this little opening here but only on the front in the back there is a little opening but it is small in here as you can see uh, besides the S there is those holes opening up so yeah that's basically the figure I'm gonna try to read the instructions and see you guys again later on. So guys, this is the second style of the figure. So before, the default one is only the figure itself. But on the second one, it has the shield in her hand, which is I already reviewed before. So yeah, this is the second version. So I'm just gonna put it in the stand with this version one. So yeah, see you guys again next time. So guys, here she is in the stand. But the one thing I noticed is that she is flying. So her feet doesn't touch the ground or the base, as you can say, or the stand because it has this little thing to make her stand. So yeah, this is basically the figure and on the default hands it is default as you can see so yeah so in the box there is some writings there it says that it is a glittering eye but I don't really see that maybe it's because it's reflecting lights or something but yeah this is the final figure so i'm gonna give you a cinematic shot thank you guys for watching like share comment and subscribe also the full specification of the figure will be shown in the end of the video thank you guys for watching